Therapeutic value of the food material is, is described in Ayurveda into great detail. All the grains, lentils, vegetables, spices. This kulthi, kulthi is a very nice lentil. It's rare but very much recommended for so many conditions in Ayurvedic, in Ayurvedic text. This kulthi is growing into rocky, rocky area I have seen in my state Jharkhand growing into rocky area means Rishis has found out that if, if it can grow in the rocky sandy soil means it must have some intelligence to get into the rocky soils so it must have some intelligence to intelligence to disintegrate the calcification or create create in the body anti calcification intelligence so there are uh, very much into tradition in india if anybody has any gallstone or any kidney stone or any uh, other kind of calcification we recommend the Vaidyaj has been promoted this Kulti Dal so much. People are automatically starting to uh, eat uh, as, a, as a lentil. Let us see what Sutra is saying here. This Sutra is from Rajnigantu, one of the very famous uh, herbology book. Says that Kulthika, Kulthika is the Sanskrit name, Katu Stikta. It's a it's little bit Katu mildly pungent and bitter and swadhyars sulanasani it's it's a very nice tasty it tastes good but it can help it's so light and so sharp it can help in a, a colic pain in the abdomen it's not for medical situation but you know day-to-day -day thing it's uh, for the teaching purposes and arsanasani because so light and channel opening and uh, unclogging the channels and also getting rid of if any unwanted uh, unwanted material is there are there in the physical channels it can clean that so it can help in the hemorrhoids also and nasni. it can help if somebody has tendency of getting constipated, not in a medical way, but day-to-day -day way, Advana Nasni, it opens the channel, so helps to help the Samanavata of the stomach circulate better. And it's Chakchushya, because it's a channel opening uh, and it has a lot of nutrients, it helps the Chakchu, Chakchushya. It is making the eye more healthy. And Branar opening because it cleans the channel so that uh, any wound or ulcers can get more prana from the different part of the body so it can support the body to heal the ulcers so this is this is about kulti and you know one thing about you have to know that's very tough to cook because it it is having a lot of power so you have to first grind it grind in a coffee grinder and then cook and don't eat it don't eat it alone it's very powerful so 20 percent kulti and 80 percent mung dal mung lentil or masoor dal and cook like a lentil with your normal spices whatever spices you like or whatever spices are recommended then it cooks in 20 minutes under cover cover it and cook in 20 minutes and it will add flavor to your lentil but at the same time this possible uh, therapeutic uh, benefit will be there. Thank you.